bring it on, baby! G Soto 98 with another Gears of War review. This time from Gears of War 1, Series 1. The best figure in the Gears of War line. Yes, you heard me. Series 1, Augustus Cole, baby. Yes, I got Augustus Cole actually today. Actually, just unboxed him. I paid, believe it or not, the very hard to find Augusta Cole, I paid 20 bucks for him. That's a bargain, because I've seen these th this guy go for like 145 bucks on eBay. I was just kidding about that. I've seen, this. it goes up to $9 and goes up to like 40 bucks or something. I'll pay 40, but for a six inch figure, it's kind of rough. Um, anyways. This is a great figure. Now, let's go into the packaging. Um, we have a nice picture of Augustus Cole right here. Player select, Augustus Cole, baby. We have a nice picture of Augustus Cole right here. And Augustus Cole is actually also one of my favorite characters in the game. Um, we have a nice figure of him right here. And you see his earring. He does actually have earrings, too, the figure. It says Gears of War right there. I hope you can read this right here. There you go. It's going, it's going, it's gone. Nice picture of him right there. Gears of War, Gus is cool. Nice, uh, got a couple of nice pictures of him right here. Collect them all. Now this is series one and two. We have Marcus Phoenix, Locust Drone, Gus is cool, baby. Oh, excuse me. Locust Sniper, Dominic Santiago, Theron Guard, Demon Baird, and Theron Sentinel. I got this guy at Big Kid. I did not get this guy at my local Toy Mandala store. Um, actually, my Toy Mandala store had all of these when they first came out. They had uh, Marcus Phoenix, um, uh, what's the other guy? A Locust Drone, Locust Sniper, and they had, of course, the one and only Augustus Cole. They, these, all of them sold fast, except for Augustus Cole. They had about, like, five, eight Augustus Cole uh, figures in stock. Um, they kept dropping down the price from, they were about 20 bucks at the time. They dropped down to 14, 12, 10, and then it got, finally got down to about five bucks. And, um, and then they just sold them, and then... This guy was never seen in stores again, so I'm finally glad. I finally got him. I'm so glad. Uh, let's uh, have a look at the um, the uh, accessories first. We have a snub nose pistol that he holds better than the Lancer, sadly. And then a uh, very nice detail. I like this very much. We have a, the Lancer, blah, blah, blah. Not really going to get into that. And wow! Anyways. Um, it's pretty cool. He can't hold this, sadly. He can only hold the uh, snub pistol. But, um, and play Gears of War. If you don't, I will slap you in the face. I'm just kidding, but it's a great game. Um, let's have a look at it. Gus is cool, baby. And boom, here's the man. The man. The man's in the party, yes. The Let's have a look at his detail before we get into the articulation. The articulation! Nice sculpt and he doesn't want to focus. My camera never wants to focus. Uh, so very nice. Um, and then he's got his happy skull. It focuses on the skull, but it doesn't focus on the face. Great. He's got his earrings that you will never see. Um, nice armor all around. His muscles, his veins, um, his buckles, his everything. His um, ammo pouches, whatever you want to call them. His boots, his everything all around is just fantastic. His gloves. Now, ah. Uh, Let's try to move him over here. Yeah, you can see him much better now. He's got his beard and everything. The one problem I do have with the paint 
is right there. You see that, like, mark on his head right there? Yeah, that's about it. Um, and his earring. Yeah, you can see his earring now, kind of. Maybe. I don't know how it'll show up on YouTube, but it's um, pretty good. Uh, now, let's have a look at the articulation before we actually show him with his uh, snub pistol. I will not try to put the lancer in um he's he his head turns uh kind of it turns but it turns like uh, now he's like actually that looks kind of cool it's like what up um but yeah it's meant to look this way anyways um it kind of is uh kind of like stuck but that's just because he's new i just got him like i said his arms go up and down, in and out. He swivels at the elbow, swivels at the wrist, swivels at the waist. He his um he he um his leg can turn right here, but sadly um uh, I haven't gotten mine to move yet. Um he can bend right here at the knee, and that's it. Oh, and he also has a knife right here that can't come off. Uh, not that Cole needs it. <clears throat> He's already such a B.A. Um, that's, uh, I'll, tr I'll put the snub pistol in his hand. Uh, bear with me, guys. You guys can go get a sandwich right now if you want. There we go. Come back. Break time's over. Yeah, yeah. I like posing him like this. It doesn't look so good on, I don't think it looks so good on camera, but it's, it definitely looks cool like, like that. Yeah. Like, boom, bang, 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 bang. You dead, Lucas. Yeah, woo, bring it on, baby. Bring it on, sucker. Anyways, um, very nice figure. My overall verdict on him. Um, if you find him, buy him. Don't even think twice. Just, you see him. Oh, that's Gus's cold. Grab the package, pay for it, leave the store. Because he is definitely awesome. I want to buy the Dominic Santiago now. Um, verdict, I give him a 5 out of 5. The best Gears of War figure. Yes. Um, well, the best Gears of War figure that I've bought so far. So, upcoming reviews. Ram and Kim. Uh, yeah, I'll review Ram and Kim. I got this for Christmas. I got these two guys for Christmas. Grenadier Elite Blarg and Colonel Victor Hoffman. Love Hoffman now. I, like I said, I wasn't this big fan before, but I started playing as him, and I like him now. So you can expect reviews on them, uh, the, those two guys, uh, soon. And you can look out for some more Gears of War 1 and 2 playthroughs. Um, so this is G Soto 98 signing off, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Woo, yeah, bring it on, sucker!